Hey, what's up beautiful people it's in our welcome to the channel today we'll have this very interesting video and a side to lying to your dying wife feat rashida jones key and peel hmm awesome i'm excited to check this one out let's check it out Come on. Yes. I'm here. I promise you'll never forget about me. Yes. Hmm. Of course. Promise me you'll take care of our little girl. Love her. Yes. With all my heart. Promise me you'll stay strong for her. Yes. Yes. I promise. And promise me you'll never sleep with another woman. I hear you. Oh my god. <laughs> promise me you'll take care of Mr. Big Fluffy Tail. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That, that cat will be the most Loved cat in the world. And that you won't look at porn. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Huh? Ooh. Oh, what's my Is that yes? Check it, 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 check No pornography. Buster Brown says what? What? Is that a yes? Yo. <laughs> I believe I heard while she was saying, girl. You love me, right? Yes. I love you. Yes. And we're soulmates, right? Yes. So you will never, ever, ever think of someone else while masturbating, right? Message received. I don't understand. Is that a yes? Yo comprende. Is that a promise? <laughs> Your request has been filed. Say you promise. Forget about. Huh? What? <laughs> I need to hear you say it. it I pr no, say I pro I promise. You promise. You. You promise. This is not real. Say it. Okay, I promise. No air quotes. Promises are things that love you. Say it. I promise. I promise. What are you promising? I promise what you said. Oh, I forget it. Yes. Come here. Okay. You at least promise to go see my mom every day. So zero pornography? Done. I like that. Nurse! Fix my wife! <laughs> <laughs> Don't touch me right now. This is not, it's not all about you. <laughs> what did I just watch? No, this has to be a comedy. I believe this is a comedy and this is not real. What? The when you got to the part where she told him, promise me you will not sleep with another woman or think of Just imagine his dying wife. But of course, I mean, I know f f most times it might be hard for men and the likes and all of that. But just him making that kind of promise. <sighs> Let alone what you promise. I'm going to see the mother-in-law. Oh my God. I know that sometimes there are some nice mother-in-laws and the lights and everything, but this was really interesting and it was fun at the same time. I mean, at first I, I felt really bad because she was lying in the hospital bed and I'm like, ah, oh, she, she's passing. She's, she, she's going to pass away anytime soon. And here he, he, she had her husband by her side make, making all of these promises. But when he got to that part <laughs> about the woman, that was when I realized that, 
Oh no 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 something is up. <laughs> but yo, this was really good. It was interesting. I love this. I it was interesting to see and put a smile on people's faces regardless. But um beautiful my thoughts and prayers out to those people who have lost a significant other in any way and are going through to any form of grief right now just know that the lord is with you and um, god knows best and there is always going to be a joy on the other side of the tunnel just stay strong hold on strong because it's not always a beautiful thing to lose somebody but sometimes <sighs> that's just life and life continues don't beat yourself up you still have to live your life regardless and we i know that is hurtful and is very is very hurtful to lose someone especially for somebody you love let alone your spouse or somebody that you planned on spending the rest of your life with it's hurtful and the likes but all the same life goes on but yeah let me know what your thoughts are in the comment down below what are your thoughts about this so far um have you at any point lost any loved one or significant other what moment was that like and what promises were made on the sick bed and everything or do you still remember the promises that when you that were made during that time or when um, on the sick bed and everything i really love your thoughts on this i mean everybody have gone through different series and stages of grief and it's not to make anybody to relieve those moments some people might be going through that stage and might just need some sense or word of encouragement from you or something that will lift somebody's day up or somebody up and i would really love you to share in the comment down below you can also share other useful information you think might be really helpful and until next time see you in the next video